Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to go through the kettlebell Romanian deadlift or the stiff leg deadlift. Okay, before you get into this, uh, the Romanian deadlift, I would recommend you learning how to do an actual kettlebell deadlift. Okay, so if you want to learn that, just link up here. This will take you to the, uh, the how to uh, deadlift video. Okay, so the difference between the stiff leg and the, uh, or the Romanian and the regular deadlift is there's going to be less bend in the knees. Okay, so this is going to put more of an emphasis on the hamstrings. Okay, so what I mean by this, so the regular deadlift looks like this. So see my knees are slightly bent, and from here you're just going to stand straight up and back down. The Romanian deadlift, you will deadlift it up, and then from here you're going to put a slight bend in the knees, and then from here you just articulate around the hips. The knees don't move from this point, okay? So from here, slight bend, just articulate around the hips, around the hips, around the hips, to a point where you can't go anymore. This will get very tight, and come straight back up. Okay, so what I like to use on this, a good cue, is as you're going down, you should be able to wiggle your toes because your hips are moving back. The weight should kind of move to the back of your hip, to, the, to your heel. Okay, so let me show you how that looks. From here, as you're going down, you should be able to wiggle your toes as your hips are going back, as the weight, the distribution is getting towards your heel. And as you come back up, really dig your toe into the floor, drive up, squeeze your bum. Okay, so from here, down, 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 Do toes in, up, squeeze your bum. Okay, okay, so that's the Romanian deadlift, stiff leg. This is just more for the hamstrings, okay? 